Hello everyone and welcome or welcome back to today's video. I am so happy to have you here. Um, thank you for being here when you could be watching any of the big YouTubers. Froggy Crossing, Lex Play, List the Last, Tiger, any of them. You could be watching any of them. But no, you chose to watch me and I really appreciate you for that. And today we're just doing a little campsite build. If I sound out of breath it's because I raced down here again to... Yeah, I race down here again. I don't know why. Every time I go to record, I start to race down here. But yeah, I don't know. But yeah, so we're doing a campsite build. This took me literally five hours to make. Yeah, it was ridiculously long. But you know, I don't know why it was so long. But I trimmed it into a 22 minute video. So hope you enjoy it. And I will come back whenever I feel like I need to say something. So here I am just grabbing some items and I already moved the campsite as you saw and I really love how this turned out and it's so cute but um, I took a long time to, took, to grab some items and I don't know why but I just could not decide on what items I wanted. I came back and forth throughout the whole video you'll see. Then, then there was a treasure island mess it was a whole thing so please just bear with me bear with me. So here I am just fixing up the rivers because I'm going to put a diagonal bridge right here and it, it'll look so good. Actually, it does look good I'm acting like I'm not doing voiceover this. I am doing voiceover, but it looks so good. But this river gave me a lot of pain. And so um, I was going to go ahead and go all the way around because there's like another river at the entrance. I was going to make it a circle, but I did not have the energy to do that after five hours. So I will do that in a let's play or something like that or another speed build. But for now, it looks really good, and I'm really happy with the way it turned out, and I'm saying and a lot, and I don't know why I'm saying and a lot, but again, bear with me. I'm tired. <laughs> Excuse me. And so this, <coughs> this is the bridge that I decided on. Um, and it, it's like the flat bridge. And I needed money to build it. And so I went to the ABD. I'm going to try to say not and. But so I went to the ABD. Now I'm going to pay it. And I'm going to time travel. So I will see you the next day.
so this sounds like a Christmas song, but I promise it's not. Uh, and I don't know why they made it sound like a Christmas song, but they did. I time traveled out of the fall season because I could not decorate with it like that. I just could not. But I'm going to let you guys watch because here I am starting to actually decorate. Yeah. And then after this, I don't decorate the campsite for a little while. IRL time. But yeah, I really like how this turned out. So just watch. So here I start to decorate this little flower field area that I made. Um, it's a whole thing for flowers. I try to go to Treasure Islands. I make it to Treasure Island. It doesn't have flowers. And then I search my island for flowers. And then I didn't have any other co yellow cosmos. So I ended up settling for a few yellow cosmos. It was a whole thing. So just, just watch. I can't even explain it. You're going to have to watch for yourself to see the struggle.
Okay, but do you see uh, what I mean by how cute this is? Like, it's just adorable. Like, a little pathway to go into the campsite. I love it. I did not have a campsite sign. I'm going to put a campsite sign up on the cliff. But eventually, whenever I decorate that. And I will make sure that I have it. Uh, and hopefully, I'll have it. Because, <laughs> you know me. You can't trust me if I'll have it or not. But... <laughs> I will try my hardest to remember. And here I am actually searching for it. Or I was searching for it. Then I couldn't find it. Yeah. But I started this pathway. And I don't know what I was doing here with the fencing. Um, not just in my pockets, but also placing it. Literally both. I don't know why I organized my pockets this way. I just did. Okay. So I put this fencing back. I don't know why I did that. I fix it later. You'll see. And it looks a lot better later. But yeah, so and then I realized I can go through here, so now I'm just gonna put a simple wooden fencing right there. But yeah, um, there I am trying to put the rose again because I'm gonna put flowers in the rose, then I'm gonna put like little kids' tents. It's gonna be like a, it turns out adorable. You'll have to see for yourself. Okay, so I'm just going to let you guys watch and listen for the rest of the video until I get to the end because I really have nothing to say, actually, and I just think that that would be best, so, yeah, and also here I am trying to go to the Treasure Islands, and, yeah, y'all y'all see, just watch, I'll talk to you guys at the end.
Okay everyone, the build is finally finished and I'm so happy with the way it turned out. Was it a long time in the coming? Like five hours of sitting and recording? Yes. Yes it was. Was it worth it? Yes. Yes it was. I'm so happy. I really am glad that I stuck to it and that I finished this build because it made me inspired to play Animal Crossing again because I really love it. And shout out to April Honey. She's the one that actually made me want to do this build. <laughs> I was watching her Mush Island playlist. I'm not sure what the island name is, but like her Mush Island, and that's what inspired me is all the Mush items. So yeah, shout out to her. And it just turned out so, so cute. And thank you, April, for inspiring me to do this. And thanks for watching, and I hope you enjoyed. But just look at all the kids' tents, all the bright flowers, and they all kind of match together with the pop of orange. And I really love it so, so much. And as you can see, I did fix it. I put the bunny day partition. It looks so good. But yeah, thanks for watching, and I really hope that you enjoyed it. I could tell you right now that I love the way this turned out, and that there will be more videos coming out if I can record them. So yeah, thanks for watching, and I hope to see you in my next one. Again, really happy with how it turned out. Shout out to April Honey, and I will leave a link to her channel in the description, and I'll see you in the next one. Bye-bye!